Battle for Brafia moves to U.S. as Simon Epa signs 200 and 205 million naira lobby deal. Good morning, everyone, and thank you all for tuning in and listening to this headline. As our headline for this morning it says here that Battle for Brafia moves to the U.S. as Simon Epa signs a 250 million naira lobby deal. Well, leader of the autopilot faction of the indigenous people of Brafia, Simon Epa, has taken the Brafia case to the United States, seeking international support and recognition for the cause. Well, Epa, who prides himself as the Prime Minister of Brafia Republic Government in exile BLGIE, signed a substantial lobby deal worth $130,000, approximately $205 million, era, with a US-based firm, Moran Global Strategies. The deal is expected to facilitate high-level advocacy and strategic en- engagement with key stakeholders in Washington, D.C. Well, including lawmakers, policymakers, and influential think tanks t- to advance agitation for the independent state of Brafia, this move is believed marks a new chapter in the long-running campaign for Brafia independence, as EPA aims to leverage the global st- stage to bring attention to the grievance and aspiration for the Brafian people. According to Primetime reports, the Finland-based agitator applied in June 2024 to engage the service of MGS owned by former U.S. lawmaker James Moran. The letter of agreement was signed by Mr. Moran himself for the lobbying frame on June 10, 2024, while Mr. Epa signed on behalf of BRGIE on June 12, 2024. According to contract deal, BRGIE will pay MGS a monthly fee of $10,000, about $15 million naira, for services provided. The document shows that the contract commenced on 15 June 2024 and will be concluded on 14 June 2025. Monthly fees will be billed in advance on the first day of each month on due to, and due on or before the 15th day. The contract renewable upon expiration on an annual basis, says MGS will help the separative leader to convince this U.S. government and private sector to support the succession of Brafia from Nigeria. Under terms of this letter agreement, MGS agrees to provide Brafia with strategic advice and facilitate interaction with approximate members of the executive and legislative branch of the U.S. government, as well as third-party interests. MGS will support Brafia's fundamental goal to encourage the U- United States government to support Brafia independence and to recognize Brafia as the only entity which represents Brafia's part of the agreement reads. MGS will promote the narrative to U.S. governmental and non-governmental stakeholders that Brafia wants an, est- wants an established independent state with Brafia's stewardship will be closely allied to the United States as well as bulk work against Islamic terrorism in the region. Well. MGS will also educate, educate U.S. and non-U.S. stakeholders on issues of concern in penetrating the government of in penetrating the government of Nigerians, including including but not limited to human rights abuses, religious freedom issues, including persecution of Nigerians Christian, increasing Islamic fundamentalism within the Nigerian government, the Nigerian government alignment with U.S. adversaries. And border security concerns, among other topics, the agreement further um, added. It said the U.S. government would be encouraged to engage BRGIE directly through advocacy by the U.S. Congress and others, including faith-based and human rights organizations and think tanks. Well, and that is all we have for you concerning this headline today this morning, which says here that Battle for Brafia moves to the U.S. as Simon Ekpa signs a two hundred and five million naira lobby deal well someone Epa wasn't joking when he says he's going to have brafia and he's going to do it by fire or by force and if you're not a subscriber the best thing you can do right now is to tap the subscribe button hit the notification bell leave a like on this video to get more updates concerning this particular news in the next feature to come well cons- okay concerning this Simon Epa, okay the leader of the BRGIE recently signed a 250 205 million naira deal with more and um with mg with mgs yeah with mgs more global strategies and their goal is just to make show the usa the united states of america that brafia as an independent state is better for nigeria and itself because they don't they just want to show the united states that we have the power to stand on our own we want to be on our own we want to be independent like they just want to push the brafia course in the united states so that the, the, the u.s will recognize brafia as an independent state, as an independent state, yeah. Well, 
So I'm on the I've signed the deal and I was supposed to be paying MGS a monthly sal a monthly salary of ten thousand dollars. That's a that's a very that's a huge lot of money. Well, some Epa doesn't mind because his his what what is in his mind is for Bravia to stand out away from Nigeria and even if it means spending money, that is one of that is one part of his um four to do list concerning the Bravia concerning Bravia's referendum. We all know that number one is no, no, number one is disgracing the people that put in the canoe in prison and that he has said he has done number two is declaring independence and protecting breakfast homeland i said that he has done um 50 percent and number three is making international um bodies know that brafia is an independent state like want to make that like, they want to let other international bodies not, not just the u.s like french the france spain germany british know that see we are an independent state we are we, we are not part of this country called nigeria that is just that i said that he has done 60 percent and that 60 percent is what we are talking about with morang and um, global strategies the goal is just to push the brafia course in the united states of america so america will notice brafia because they said if brafia stands out on its own brafia will be closely they'll, they'll be close ally with the united states of america that's actually a good thing though but what do you guys think drop a comment in the comment section don't forget to leave a like on this video then tap the subscribe button as a big red one with the notification bell so anytime i have a new video you'll be the first to get notified about it once again thank you for tuning in and have a wonderful day ahead of you